everyone um in this video i'm gonna do percentage change whether percentage increase or percentage decrease i'm gonna look at an example but i'm gonna look at one example and then i'm gonna explain for you you get this formula this formula usually in medslit they'll give it to you in your formula sheet it says percentage change is equals to new amount or new value that you are given minus original divide by original multiplied by uh, 100 and then when you use this uh, formula you'll get how much percentage of the change um let's look at an example in 2017 the price of petrol was 15 rand 28 increased in the same year it increased to 18 rand 32 cents then we are asked to calculate the percentage of change in the price of petrol in 2017 they're actually asking you what is the percentage change let's start the first thing that you do you write the formula even though you'd be given the formula in the in the question question paper write it in your answer book first right uh, you have written the formula percentage change is equal to new amount minus original amount divided by original multiplied by 100 percent so the new amount here the price was 15 rand 38 and then it increased to 18 rand 32 so the new amount is 18 rand 32 minus the original price it's 15 rand 38 divide by the original price 15 rand 38 cents then you're gonna multiply everything by 100 percent let's take our calculator and do right it. it's 18 rands 32 cents minus 15 rand 38 cents then you get two rand two rand 0.94 divided by 15.38 times 100 percent then if you're using electronic display you can just go fraction then 2.94 go down 15.38 and then multiply it by 100 then the answer that you'll get it will be the percentage it's 19,12 percent so what does this mean it means that the price has increased with 19,12 percent so this is how much the the price has increased um, from 1538 to 1832 okay when you get an answer that is negative it means the price has decreased when you get an answer that is positive it means the price has increased so that's how we deal with a negative and positive uh, this is the end of our lesson thank you for watching